Lego everybody, today we're going to be looking at a relatively old Lego Star Wars set. This is Anakin's Jedi Starfighter. This is set number 7669. Um, this set came out in 2008. Um, so yeah, it's relatively old, um, about 7 years. But um, it's not really old enough to be vintage, you know. Um, this set contains 153 pieces and retailed for $20. Now, this is a great set. <laughs> you cannot believe how much I've played with this um, since I got, I got it probably in 2008. Um, absolutely love this set. One of my favorites in my collection. Uh, so, yeah, let's get right in into it. We get two minifigures, so let's look at them right now. Alright, so the two minifigures we get in this set is obviously Anakin and R2-D2. So let's start off with our good friend R2-D2 right here. Um, so very cool, obviously. It's R2-D2, uh, our, one of our favorite uh, astromic droid. Um, very cool. Uh, Lego has changed his design a bit in the past years, so this is kind of an older version of him, as you can see. Very nice classic R2-D2 design on him. And obviously he's got the moving legs right here. So yeah, R2-D2. <laughs> and here we have Anakin. So obviously he comes with his classic blue lightsaber right here. And here is Anakin. Very cool design. Um, this is a Clone Wars set, so this is more of the Clone Wars TV episodes version of Anakin. Um, very nice hair piece, the classic sort of spacing right here of his hair. So very nice. Um, he has his scar on his eye, as you can see right there. Nice detail. Big blue eyes. Um, very nice detail on his torso right here with his Jedi robes. And just black legs. So very nice detail on him. So those are the figures in this set. Alright, so here is the model of this set, Anakin Starfighter. Um, so, very nice design. I love how it's got all the yellow on it. So, I'll go ahead and give you kind of a 360 view. Whoop. <laughs> right here. So, this set has uh, a fair amount of stickers. It's not too bad. Um, so, this Starfighter has different features. Um, the wings can fold like this. Um, there's flick fire missiles right here. Um, I've always had difficulty shooting these ones. They're a bit hard to get to. But again, flick fire missiles have never been the easiest thing. Um, they got folding feet right there on the Starfighter. So very cool. So right there, I got three of them. Very nice. And an interesting function, if you get uh, R2-D2 right here and set him right here, there's this button at the back right here that if you push hard, it ejects him. It ejects him. Well, that went superb, as you can see. Like that, basically. So if there's an emergency, R2-D2 can just pop out. And we've got the cockpit right here, and we've got a control panel in there as you can see. Um, there's even space um, to put uh, Anakin's lightsaber if you take off the blue parts. So technically his lightsaber is um, sort of turned off. Um, you can put it right here. It fits in. Um, very. So that's very nice. So yeah, it's got stickers right here, here on the front. And yeah, just overall a very nice set. It's a Starfighter, so it's pretty much uh, the same a design as others with a few tweaks. So yeah, that's pretty much all there is to the Starfighter. Very cool design. Really like it. Had lots of fun with uh, the functions. Um, yeah. Alright, so that is Anakin's Jedi Starfighter. Very cool Star Wars set. Um, to me, this is kind of a classic. It's just a great uh, Starfighter. Lots of nice playable functions. Um, 
So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I don't know if you could call this a review. It's not a vintage video either. Just kind of a look, I guess you could say, at uh, this great set. Um, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like on this video. And don't forget to subscribe <laughs> and leave a comment if you have this set and if you've played with it a lot. Um, and if you're watching this on my blog, don't forget to follow my blog and share this post. And as always, thank you all for watching. Thank you.